Okay. So we got the piano house over here, rocking the nice fountains in the front on either side of the yard. You slowly walk down the driveway. What's this? A few chairs, lawn chairs, nice little handles. Get to sit and relax, watch the neighbors. Then we come in the house, and we see the first living room. Got a nice horror movie, rock in it. Some shelves for our DVDs, yet to be released. Couch, sitting area, very nice. We open these two doors, take a left turn, and we have the guest bedroom. Safety first, that's why we have guardrails. And another TV, because we are very American in here. And you go down the hallway, walk into the kitchen, and you got your vending machines, your various things. Got your kitchen, sink, dishwasher, some coffee makers. Got a little place for making cake and such. Got the furnaces, ovens. Some root beer, some beer, some cotton candy. <laughs> Approach the bathroom, and it appears a hobo is using my shower. I thought I got rid of the last one, but whatever. Ignoring that, we have a nice toilet over here, and the hobo ran away. Got some sinks and some more dishwashers. Never know when you're going to need those. And then we have a nice bathtub here. Perfect height for relaxing. Come back through the kitchen. Go through the main hallway one more time. One more time to the living room, and we get a nice music room. Play some music. Get whatever you need out of storage. Play some CDs. And we can come upstairs. First room you see when you go upstairs is the office. Like to do some architecture here. That's why I got some blueprints. Got a few Windows computers. That I like Apple. Apple is evil. Then the master bedroom. Very nice guardrail on the master bed. Then we have some paintings to admire. Some clothes closets. And some bookshelves, because we like to educate ourselves. Here's the other elusive guardrail. Yes, and we are preventing sex with this. Then you come into the second living room, and this is the room in which we live. Sometimes we watch TV, but most of the time we're converting CO2 into O2. And then you go out onto the deck, and you see a nice garden of roses. Then you look down in the center, and you see a nice little pool where fishes and hobos usually reside, and a nice daisy garden. That's about it for the inside. Okay, now we're in the backyard. Very nice fire pit over here. Comfortable for sitting, telling campfire stories, and dark and scary nights. Or, you know, you could just throw somebody in the fire if they're being really annoying. I mean, I don't discriminate. And then right next to that thing, is a table, a picnic table, and we have and we have these center fire seats in case you're cold on a winter day. Get your legs nice and warm. And then right here we have a nice tree that I grew in the backyard, and it developed into a small swamp. Got some lily pads in there too. Sometimes you see monkeys in those trees. I guess today isn't one of those days, though. And then you have a pool area. And some nice lounge chairs. You also have a very nice walk-up area to a diving board and a water slide. 
be like. Yeah. And we have a nice piston picnic table for more formal events. Then we have a third table over here for birthdays, talking. I turn my head to the side, focus wide and thought at a time. I do not like to live.